Hey, I'm back. Hi, dollies. How are you? So this review is on Pull Up Daisy. I'm like trying not to laugh because honestly, I never thought I would review this release or nonetheless even buy her. So before I get started, I wanted to mention um, this a little bit information about Pull Up Daisy. OK, let me try to keep it together because I'm about to laugh. OK, Whew, let me tr <laughs> let me try not to laugh. OK, so she is a collaboration with artist um, Junishi Nakahara. I hope I said that right. As said here on her collector card, I will definitely put more information on the artist down below. She has the second collaboration that we have with this wonderful artist. I pretty much would tell you I prefer the first one, but that's a conversation for another time or you can look back on my live videos uh, and, and see all the things I expressed about this particular release. So trying to keep it together because usually when, yeah, let me try to keep it together. Okay, let me stop laughing. All right. So as long as you, as, uh, as always you, <laughs> I can't even talk as I always tell you all, I'm going to be honest regarding this um, review and yeah, let's, uh, let us get started. So Pull Up Daisy comes with this very pretty and neat updo, ponytail updo like this thing. I, I wish I, my hair looked like this on a daily basis. Like this thing is so neat. There's a light spray on it and she has this very pretty loose curl here. The wig itself is like chef's kiss very good quality and then the top the front here she has her bangs and they're nice and sleek and soft i mean just perfect i can't even tell you anything negative about this thing like this thing is impeccable um there is no signs of the wig cap showing to the top I mean, there's nothing negative to say about this wig. I can't even believe I'm saying that. Um, the color, as you can see, it's like almost like a real like dark brown brunette. I'm even looking. Should we kind of match a little bit there? Kind of similar, like really good color they chose there. Um, just very pretty. I can't even tell you anything negative. This doll is based on an art piece. And there's been many variations of her made in different doll companies. So I just wanted to put that out there in case you were wondering. So, but I'm very impressed with this wig. Very, very pretty. And the way that it's held, as you can see here to the top with a rubber band. And it's nice and thick and on there it's pretty nice and then she has this ribbon bowl that you just put on the top there with a clip and that's pretty much it i have like a pigeon right outside my house so if you hear it i am so sorry and as you could tell i'm trying not to laugh but it is what it is i actually covered her eyebrows with her bangs because i just couldn't anymore i couldn't look at it anymore so if she looks different that's why i covered her freaking eyebrows so now let's talk about her face up which includes her eyebrows so when you get her in box her uh, she looks like she styled like this now it won't stay because i guess i kept it on too long like oh my gosh <laughs> okay let me show you these eyebrows <laughs> so this is her face up girl we need help here okay so she this is her face up these are her eyebrows which are arched and super thick um yeah and then we have these very pretty natural brown eye chip color um chips very pretty with the natural cat eye not too dramatic very pretty i do love that and then her cheeks we do have some color with red and then we have these bold bright red lips so that is how she looks like as you all can tell by my um face i need to cover those eyebrows because girl i just can't let's let's cover them i just can't look at them they, they drive me they drive me crazy so i am covering those suckers up and that's how she looks like right and then when we close our eyes she has her natural lid Am I seeing, I'm, I'm telling you, I'm blinded by these lights. No, it's a natural color lid with her black eyeliner. So what are my thoughts regarding her face up? Oh my God, it's stuck. Lately, what's going on? All these are getting stuck on me. What are my thoughts regarding her face up? To be honest with you, oh my gosh, she is stuck. She's getting revenge on me. I know she's been hearing me saying all these things about her. Don't come after me. Um, 
my thoughts about this face up is that it's pretty you know i'm not a fan as you know the bangs we all know i haven't made us i haven't even kept that to myself i'm not too much of a big fan on the opaqueness that's the best way to describe it of her lips i think they should have been a little bit lighter but is it like oh my gosh it's horrible no i think like this is really a, a good reflection of like old school type style makeup so it doesn't bother me too much um looking at her like this and of course we covered those freaking eyebrows yay they're covered so yeah that is my my those are my thoughts regarding um her face up her eyebrows gotta go but that's just beside the point so now let's talk about her <laughs> stock her stock listen very well made we have sev several different pieces here we have her cotton top with her cotton long skirt okay it's perfectly made there's nothing wrong with it i like how it's nicely fitted there's nothing here that looks awkward just very very nice and it's very soft too like the collar part part here and it's held in the back by velcro the only downside that i see here is this annoying pleather belt that they put here because it's gonna flake through time but it's nothing too serious okay but the stock itself is very nicely made simple but nicely made and then she does come with her gloves you have to put these on when you get her out of the box just put them up gently and they're not gonna fall off easily unless you're like literally pulling them down so i wanted to mention that beneath this she does come with a tool skirt to help with the fullness look of the skirt and give her that poof and then beneath that and again nothing negative to say about the tool she comes with these bloomers cotton style bloomers nicely made and then besides that she's not wearing them because they keep falling off um are her white shoes they're literally like your simple flats nothing too crazy to talk about as you can see here oh gosh here we go nothing too crazy to talk about oh ah! i am such a klutz um so yeah that's how they look like and then when you put them on let me see these things are huge oh geez these things are oh god they're huge these things are pretty huge i'm so dramatic sometimes hold on mm, yeah listen y'all these things are huge yeah these things are huge let's compare the shoe next to her foot so you kind of get an idea you see wait yep it's pretty big so yeah they're just your plastic shoes i'm gonna take them off because they're gonna fall off right now so just be very careful with that so this is how she looks like with her first look you're like what she comes with a second look yes she comes with an extra dress which this is like her her nice i would say like a nice nightgown to go to bed very pretty very lightweight very soft cotton fabric it's pretty thin but it's strong fabric um i don't have anything negative or concerns or anything concerns any concerns to share with about this very nicely made and then it's held in the back by your velcro nothing too crazy just very pretty very pretty besides that she also does come with a pillow with like i would call it like a nature print color on it we have these two a branch with two leaves i'm not sure if this is supposed to be the sun i know this is definitely a reference probably to the art piece if i find anything on on that i'm going to put it down below on this description and the thing is about this pillow in case you're curious it is a pillow case if you want to take it off you could and the pillow itself that it comes with in case you were wondering in case you're curious and you're like me that always wants to look and touch everything this is how it looks like it literally looks like a real pillow that you would get at the store like you could feel like there's you know, like cotton stuffing probably in there and then you're just your cotton fabric like i said like a real pillow and so yeah it does come with the pillow cover in case you're curious i know i don't know if i'm the only only weirdo that sometimes wants to be exploring and taking things apart like that and then there is a velcro and then bam that's how you you close it and then besides that she does come with a bouquet of flowers these things are very cute like her bouquet is so freaking cute look at this 
so pretty and it's made out of like just like it seems like paper to be honest with you like the flower part seems like paper just wires as well it's very nice it looks very cute could she hold it now that's where the trick part comes again not really um it's one of those things i would tell you put her put it toward her body like this so she could hold it okay and then besides that what else does she come with so she comes with the music sheet um again i know this is a reference to the actual art and the music sheet looks like this and i cannot read this language i'm not sure what language it is right now at the top of my head but this is how it looks like and i'll be honest with you all i'm a little a, a, a pinch disappointed with this because it's literally a piece of paper it's not like how with pull up mystica that i just reviewed that the cards had a little bit of like uh, like they were a little bit on the thick side so you can't bend them but this is literally just like a piece of paper they just printed and that was it like they could have done i feel like how they did with pull up mystica they could have done the same thing with this music sheet because this is going to get crumpled and then to the back this is what that looks like i'm sure these are lyrics but once again i cannot read it i'm not sure what language that is i don't know if anyone wants to tell me but that's what it is on the back and then again to the front the music sheet and what's a pain in the neck about this let me tell you when you're taking this out of the box they wrapped it in this plastic you'll see in the photos i'll put on instagram later that the plastic is so they put a lot of tape on this damn plastic sorry for my language they put a lot of tape on this plastic um and this plastic cover whatever and then you're trying to take it out of the box and in the process of you taking it out you're bending this because this is like stuck like i said this is so flimsy and it just got wrinkled like it was really hard not to have this happen so wanted to mention that and then besides that she does come with her collector card where to show off her eyebrows <laughs> yeah that's her collector card yeah and then that's basically it. So what are my final thoughts regarding Pull Up Daisy? I'll tell you, listen, I've got I've warmed up to her a little bit ever since, you know, you've heard me talk about her almost, it feels like a year now. Um, I've warmed up to her. Is she one of my favorite releases in the world? No, she's not. That's no secret. You all know how I am. But you all know I like to be objective with my reviews and tell you the truth if you are a fan of this artist and you would like this release i'll be very honest and objective you would be very happy because i think the art piece the art if i find it i'll put it up here somewhere is so i mean it's accurate like i don't think there's anything here that'll tell you oh, it doesn't seem accurate to what no it's very accurate so if you are a fan i think you would be very happy you're getting a doll with good quality stock you're getting a doll with extra an extra outfit that's not, not not something you see every day and she's getting a pillow so you got you have things to work with here so when we talk about like value and if you're a fan i think you'll be happy is she a versatile release i can't believe i'm even going to say this i could actually see that happening because of her color of her wig and her face her lips may be a little bit bold but I think you can make things happen with her. She could be your pretty versatile kind of girl. So negative wise, I don't have anything negative to say about her. Again, with me, things with me is just a matter of preference. Like, like I said, I'm not a big fan of the brows, but that's just me. Everything else is fine. Like she's good. She's good. She's good. Um, and like I said, and she comes with different accessories. You don't see that every day. So where could you get her? I know right now as of the filming of this video, by filming me filming this video, she's still in stock at pullupstyle.com and Groove. So I'll put those links there in case you want to check her out. And then that's basically it. Um, those are all my final, those are my final thoughts regarding this release. I hope you found this review helpful and I will see you all on the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>